I'm at some new construction here in Coweta County, and I want to show the grounding of this main panel. Uh, since the main disconnect or main breaker for the house is in the panel, the neutrals and the ground can be connected or bonded at this point. But what I want you to see is we're just going to look at the number six ground wires. Those are the two thick wires at the bottom. They exit the panel. And we'll step back and you'll see them right there. This is how we're going to ground that panel. They come, they're heading over to a grounding bar, but this first one just goes up, heads outside. We'll see it later in another video. That's going to be attached to a grounding block for exterior electrical equipment to be attached to. The second wire continues along, well, continues along the wall and goes to what is referred to as an oofer ground. The oofer ground is where the ground wire is attached to the rebar and that rebar goes down and attaches to the other rebar in the footer of the foundation thus grounding the system to the ground itself. The second wire coming back off of here travels back and exits low, and that goes out to a ground bar, um, a ground rod, excuse me. So when you're looking at this in new construction, obviously that'll be sheet rocked over, there should be a window where that blocks is with a cover plate on it that would allow you to see the oofer ground. You'll step outside and on the next video you will see what's outside.